Uh, this event is so important because it brings together the leading people in academia, industry and government in one place in an intense environment to really try and unlock some of these changes. And because on decarbonising aviation is such a challenge, it's going to require all those players to work together if we're really going to accelerate change. It's so important to take part in this event today because we need to show the amazing things that the industry is doing around sustainability. And um, it's also great to bring together the different stakeholders from across finance, policy, and technology. Ultimately, it's how we synchronize our efforts and maybe most importantly, synchronize our progress with the policymakers in Washington, D.C. and everywhere else in the world some ahead of, the, of, of, of this country, some behind. But it's how we synchronize, in my opinion, that gets us to 2050. What we're seeing with an event like this is we're bringing together leaders um, in the various sectors, from finance, uh, from the aerospace sector, from government, who can make a difference and do something about it and coming together and work on solutions. So it's great to be part of this. And then I look forward to how we translate the type of things we discuss here into actually doing more um, and, and tackling the challenge. The biggest challenge for aviation to me today is the sustainability challenge. It's the challenge of balancing two things, flying without significant environmental impact and on the other hand really connecting the world and doing what aviation really needs to do is bring people together and connecting the world giving us all the experience and the world as we know it today. One of my jobs is to go around the world and listen to what is actually happening in different sectors and different countries and with different communities. So it's really important to come to places like a Boeing event around sustainable aviation fuels to meet new people to listen to their agenda and their conversation and to connect the dots between that and many other in, uh, conversations and cooperations worldwide. What I'd like people to take away from today is I think if you really thought about most people's lives, somehow aviation is integral to their life. Somehow aviation has brought a lot of societal benefits to the world, connected the world, and I think post-COVID that's even more important for the industry. So I'd like them to sort of take that away, but I also want them to know this is an industry that's highly, highly focused on the carbon emissions associated with the industry and is working hard on it to find real credible solutions, and it's going to take the parties that are in the room today to do that.